The world is an amazing place. There is so much to do and so much to see. And I want you all to do it with me. So fix your crown and let's go on an adventure. Hey guys! Welcome back to my channel. Hey! I'm so excited! Hi guys! So here I am with Benita! She has her own YouTube channel, so do yourself a favor and subscribe to both our channels. Her link Thanks. is going to be down below and her Instagram page will be right here. Her channel is amazing, guys. Like, you actually get things out of it. It's informative. She interviews amazing people. Thank you. How did you get hurt? Girl, you hurt your hand. Could see ya. Guys, and to me, and oh my gosh, how? You know, you make the things to can be done, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, her channel is amazing, it's hilarious and informative. So, do yourself a favor. And yeah, so I remember beginning of actually last year when I left YouTube for a while, uh, I had a video where I was writing about what you guys say to vendor people, and it also relates That's to. That's funny. <laughs> That's so funny. It also relates to our Tanga princess over here because uh -huh. we get the same dumb questions. <laughs> so a lot of people ask us to teach them our languages and in the ranks I said, hell no, learn yourself. We don't have education degrees. Uh, no, we are not your show ponies. We are not going to speak vendor for you on command and we are not going to teach you. We don't all have education degrees. We are not going to teach you. However, That's literally what you said. That's so funny. That's literally what you said. However, I had a change of heart, and every time somebody asks us those questions, we're just gonna refer them to this video. Mm -hmm. And now you have no excuse to say you don't know Fenda and Tonga. Okay, exactly. okay. Cool. And when you come to Tonga, people, what's the thing they like to say? They like to say ndakupa <laughs> shweshwe or itashikuma leshishilaba. No more saying those things. Those things to Tonga people because that's the only thing you can say. It's and we know we are queen. <laughs> You know, you know, I agree. That's not the only thing we have in Tonga, guys. So it's, it's you know, a what? whole language. Exactly. It's a whole, like, step out of your ignorance for two seconds. I'm so mean to my viewers, actually. <laughs> you are so mean. Like, she's so ready to roast you guys anytime. But you know what? That's why you love her. And yeah, I love she's you guys. Real. I love people that are roast. Anyway, also, we also have a video on her channel. What's happening with my English today? Oh, let's speak Bender. That's the point of this video. Let's just speak your yeah. language. So now we'll see. <laughs> Um, Namusi means today, by the way, and yeah, in Songa that is Namunta. And Nisonga Hango will subscribe, I'll say that throughout the entire video. That don't forget to subscribe, yeah. What oh. is it in Songa? Uh, Ungarabal subscriber, yep. Okay, cool. So let's start with the basics. Hi, how are you? So usually I get even girls coming to me and saying, Dab, for my cousin. And it's just like, oh, mm. I think, okay, because I'm also learning vendor. I think to, to, mm, I think to men you say, da, and to women you say, ah, uh, I think. No, no, you say, ah, uh, as a response, right? No. Or do you say, ah, uh, to women? No. A for effort. Oh, okay. <laughs> so as a woman, you say, ah. Uh, and then oh, as a man, yeah. you say da. Yeah, that's the distinction. And this works with anyone. So even if you're greeting a man or a woman as a woman, you say ah. Yep. Yeah. Oh, okay. However, you don't have to put the vor before anybody's name. Like, <laughs> vor is for older people, like for respect, like sir, ma'am. And it's, you know, I said vor. What is that? Josie has ruined me. It's, it's a vor. Okay, that's another lesson. Uh, VH is not vo, it's vo. Vo. Yeah. Vo. Vo. Okay, vo. okay. Okay. And you know what I think must be annoying for you? Is your name is actually Makadze. You know in Mubango, there's, they always say yeah. Makadze. I'm sure that like hacks your spirit. <laughs> it does, it's such a win. Because I was in primary and I would go to school and people were like, Ah, Makadze! Mm. And you're just like... Could you not? And they used to walk like guys. I'm actually traumatized. They used to walk. Remember when my cousin used to walk like this? No. <laughs> so every time they saw me, they used to like all arch their oh, So I'm just like, I'm God. being bullied right now. Kids are mean. <laughs> Kids are mean. So how do you greet in Tonga? Okay, so in Tonga you say, I. No, actually, you know, that's how I start. You say, Avshen. And then, so let's say I say to you, Avshen. Mm. You say, I. 
And then I say, so if you're speaking to someone older than you or someone that you want to respect, you say, me njani, with an M. But if it's your peer or something casual, you say, ku njani. Oh. So you say, me njani, of which you would say, nebuki. <laughs> and then I would say Okay. There we go. Okay. So bit more than dying, uh, but yeah. <laughs> okay, actually that's not just yes, that was the full hi, how are you? Yeah. Yeah. So how are you is Nipukile Kunjani. Yeah. Okay. And then No actually Nipuke Kunjani is I'm fine, thanks and you. Okay. So how are you in particular is Kunjani or Minjani? Okay. Yeah. Minjani. Got it, got it, great. And then for our how are you is yeah, there's a lot. The layers a lot. <laughs> What's the most common one? Um <coughs> Novuahan. Yeah. Say that again? Novuahan. Novuahan. Yeah. So I would say ah, Novuahan. Yes. Ooh. And then I'll say Novuajwahud. Which direct translation means hi, how did you wake up? <laughs> Also, Mipukile is also the same, right? Yeah, because Mipukile means also I woke up or. Yeah. How did you wake up? Yeah. I woke up fine. But it's basically how are you? I know direct translation is. Oh, but a lot, like if you want to really, really impress a vendor person, the deep vendor people say, Notuan Han. Like Notuan, and then, yeah. Notuan Han. Does that mean how are you? Yeah. Oh. I, think, okay. I actually think that one, I'm not sure. I just hear deep people say Notuan, and then I'm like, yeah, I'm good. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Oh, so, like, that is impressive. That is hella impressive. So, how to shella people. A lot of people come to me like, yo, I like this vendor chick or I like this stronger chick. And how do I impress? Also, how do I, uh, I like this stronger or vendor guy? Because vendor men are kings and stronger men are kings. You know, I was at a shop once and these two ladies were just discussing and they were like, you know, real men are Tonga and Bender, the rest are just, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but of course, guys, you know, who you are all just depends on who you are, not what culture you are. So, you know, nobody catch offense. Yeah, it's not like you. And so you cuss, and then we question. I'm joking. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm not, but I'm joking. Shame. Like, if you got hurt, then I'm joking. Okay, so how do you shella? In English, what do you say? Um, I don't hey. even know how to shell a period. I don't, know. Um, I don't know what flirting is. Woo. Um, I think you go. Okay, this is what I see in the movies. You go with flowers, <laughs> and you're like, "Hey, I like you. You're beautiful." Does that happen in real life? I don't know. Comment down below if that happens. In real that life. happened to me. Maybe you know. <laughs> so fine. Hi. We already I told you guys that. Um, I like you, Mianifuna. Which could also mean I love you and it could scare the poor girl away. But yeah, the Anifuna. The Anifuna. Yes. Okay. And Nonaka, which means you are beautiful. And you are so beautiful, Nonakesa. Yeah. Okay. So if you want to say the same thing in Zonga, we already said hi. Like she said, um, I love you is Nakuranza. 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 And your beautiful is Usasekil. Mm hmm. Do you hear how sexy that is? <laughs> but, how yeah. do you say if someone wants to say like my love, my darling, what's the word for that? Mutuanga, mufuno, no mufuno wanga, my love. That's so and some people say wanga, right? Sometimes they call them people wanga. Yeah, it just means mine. Wanga, mine. Yeah. And then in Zonga? So in Zonga, to say my person, you say munwamina. Uh, yeah. Munwamina, that means my person. You can also say uh, Riranzu, you can call someone love, or Riranzu Wanga, Riranzu Amina, my love. Um, what? Yeah. So now you guys know how to share that offender and Tonga girl. Do yourself a favor, we're amazing. <laughs> I'm not saying go to us directly because our parents would kill us, but all the other girls are available. They're available. <laughs> mm -hmm. They're available. We're all princesses. Facts. Facts. <laughs> okay, so but okay. and by the way, if you do want to impress Songa and Venda people, please stop mentioning the whole Limpopo, the brooms, the you know, you know how you guys are in Venda, you know how you guys are in Limpopo. This is why this is why you can't beg uh, Songa <laughs> or Venda person because you're busy with things like that. <laughs> Say that watch the video that I had before of me <laughs> ranting. Y'all need to stop asking me if my granny is a witch, okay? Y'all just need to stop. <laughs> Why no. is that a casual conversation? 
Hi, my cousin. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Yeah, so uh, it's your birthday, which you yeah. <laughs> Wow, guys, we're not all. I know the Lipopo magic can be hectic. True, it, can. Told, it can be hectic. But we're not all like that. True. <laughs> it's not stereotyping, okay? True. Um, but I feel like a lot of families always have that one auntie they have, or that one uncle, or that one that everyone knows in the family. Yeah. They're like, ah, no, don't shake his hand, don't go to his house. <laughs> guys, you know, Pella, if you do believe in witchcraft, you know that it's everywhere. It's psh, different countries, different everything, guys. Yep. Even Ooh. white people have witchcraft. On it. What do they call it? Black magic, I think. Yep. They call it. The aunts. Mm -hmm. Let's the aunts. not forget along those uh, along the roads, you see those signs that says uh, Begamina. Those, those are Zulu signs, baby. Exactly. Oh. Exactly. Ooh. <laughs> what is it, Chianelanga? I don't know, guys. That is not Bendo or Tonga. So, check yourself. Thanks. <laughs> Okay, so also, Tonga has been used like in a lot of songs recently. Okay, not recently, since like the beginning of time. Yeah, like they just, because you know, Tonga just sounds nice in a groove. Mm. So, yeah, so Benita is going to help us dissect some of those songs. Um, first song. Okay, I used to think Kukunambia is actually Tonga, and I know a lot of people do, and apparently it's Swahili. Guys, that's a whole, you know, I was questioning my whole life as a Tonga woman, as an individual, as a person, as a member of the community. I was like, do I not know Tonga? Bro, I was like... Because I'm gay, she's listening to it, and I'm like, yeah, I'm not Tonga, and she's just like, this is not Tonga. Bro, I was like, English is this. And she's like, it's Tonga, I'm like, no, it's not. Guys, that song is in a whole entire Swahili, <laughs> and the huku she's talking about, right, we like, we searched this up. It's not yeah. huku like chicken, it's huku, I forgot what it said, it means my person or yeah. something. This whole song is about someone who didn't call, guys. It's not about chicken and beer. I was so shook when you're like, huku I was like, wait, what? A song about chicken and beer, bro? Oh, what? Yeah, so that, that one is thingy. And then, shukupu. <laughs> so what does that mean? <laughs> okay, so shigubu is drums. Uh, you, I, you can interpret it as drums. It's really drums or a beat. Mm -hmm. So it really means the drums or the beat. Shigu, it hits a lot. How does it? It's, you know, direct it translation. Slaps. It slaps. It hits it different. <laughs> yes. like, it goes hard. Um, it hits a lot and it takes you away. So the music, the beats, really just takes you away. That's what it means. Yeah, that's what it means actually. Shibango. The popular one was the one that was actually the Mubango theme song in the beginning. The OG I one. I forgot guys. about it. <laughs> the OG one. Yeah. That I'll play one. <laughs> that one actually, it's so funny, guys. So the guy says that Isati Wamila Wani Kolela. That means my wife is being mean to me, or she's yeah, she's being mean to me. If I if I should say, and the whole song is like he says see a Joni and say Umbalama Jistri. So I'm like okay, actually. So this one he says he's like Anga Alam Mujeka say Umbala Shilungu Umbalama Jistri. That means that she doesn't wear the traditional the stronger traditional skirt, you know, like Shibelani and the everything they wear. Ever since she went to Joburg and came back, she's not interested in that. Now all she wears is English. All she wears is. We say Sumbala Shilungu, she wears English. <laughs> and all she wears is G strings. That's literally what the song is about. I kid you not. And this man is so hurt. He's so upset because you know like <laughs> And they made that a whole theme song for a song. For a song. <laughs> like the love of my life, my sweet sugar babe, you know, my village honey went to We get her journey. journey. That's oh. Joe work. <laughs> and now she wears English, all she wears is G strings. I'd be tired. <laughs> Actually, as a village man, now who you know when what is it like? Everyone else's wife is wearing those traditional things. They don't doing shibelani, and your wife is just and there with a the g-string. Hi, hi, guys. She came to Joba and became a bad man, bro. <laughs> An bro. bad. Hey. Some of y'all know the story. Some of y'all left home, Colin Popo, mm -hmm. or KZN, right. or Cape, went to university. Hey. Do your parents know? Hey. Do your parents know hey. what you do? Hey. Eh? Okay. Instagram baby. Bad no. bad. Okay. Local person at taboo. Yeah. Hey. 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 Hit me up for guest list. Hey. hey. Do your best. Booking info in bio. <laughs> what are we booking you for, babes? Hey. And then when they get back home, it's the duke, it's the long hey, skirt. It's it's everything. The... They, are, they are there. They are cooking. Where does yeah. it mean? They eat at Tasha's. Hey. With... They even tell guys, I'm sorry, I only eat at Tasha's. Yes. With Oga. <laughs> hey. Hey. <laughs> You'll tell us. You'll tell us. Um, <laughs> I'm joking. We're not dragging Instagram. This is a disclaimer. We're not dragging Instagram baggies at all. 
<laughs> after the drag. Alright, cool. At the end of the day, you are who you are. Do you, boo? Do, do you, you man? Yeah, because you're children. But if you're a man, makes us all about you complaining that now all you wear G strings, what can we do? What can we do? <laughs> and then, um, so the song that, the only Vendor song that I know made it to mainstream is the Movango song, honestly. Which like was the, which one? The A A A A Movango. <laughs> but that's what they say. They don't Movango. Why isn't there a mainstream Vendor song, actually? Or the I'm sure there's been one. I'm so sure there's been one. Maybe I just forgot. Tell me in the comments section. But I don't think so. However, Muvango means um, hmm. conflict. Yeah, that is Muvango. You that know, I never amazing. thought about what I never once thought about what does Muvango mean. I always just knew Muvango is Muvango, and that's what it is. Nah, it's conflict. Like that's why the whole stro story line is drama over drama over drama with the Muvango. It's so that was us giving you some Venda wisdom. If you want to know any more, Venda, and Zonga, and Zonga, <laughs> Venda and Zonga. So if you want to know more, you can only ask in the comment section. Don't ask me in real life because y'all know, y'all know how much I hate being You honest. will catch those hands. But no, Venda and Zonga people are actually surprisingly very, very, very peaceful. True. Yeah. And smart. Yeah. And, and beautiful. beautiful. Yeah. And just overall great people and humble. <laughs> Very, very humble. <laughs> so yeah, that is from your Tonga and your Vanda princesses. Again, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. And also subscribe to Benita's channel. I, like, I'm not even exaggerating. Her channel is great. You're actually very underrated. Very. Bro. Don't worry, we'll get to those. We'll get there in time, we'll you get, know? We'll yeah. get there. Especially if our own support us. True! Dear True. Limpopo! Hello! That's on the next chair. Yes, sir! Yeah, cool! Bye! Bye, y'all!